Sailing ships are so majestic that we sometimes forget that they are made on land and must be launched out to sea. In this compilation of launches that didn't quite work out, we will show you moments when excitement and anticipation gave way to surprise intention. Get ready to witness unexpected incidents, from clumsy slips to dangerous inclines. Join us on this journey through the world of ship launches, where not everything always goes according to plan. Get ready to witness suspenseful moments and stunning twists and turns. Without further ado, let's dive into this universe full of surprises and the unforeseen. On June 16, 2012, the NOAA ship R-228 was launched at a shipyard in the state of Michigan. Before the launch, a christening ceremony took place, where a champagne bottle was broken on the ship's hull. Everything looked perfect and promising when the imposing $74 million vessel glided smoothly into the water, generating splashes and enthusiastic applause from onlookers. Despite being inclined significantly, the ship sank slightly, but soon stabilized and displayed its magnificent appearance. However, when images of the launch were released, something startling emerged. As the ship was being moved sideways into the water, one of the wooden pillars abruptly broke off, hurling sharp shrapnel at high speed everywhere. For safety reasons, it is best to stay away during a ship launch. The stern launch method is considered one of the safest, but also one of the most expensive. In this type of launching, it is crucial to determine the ship's center of gravity correctly, otherwise problems may occur. This was the case with an ice-breaking tugboat built in 2008 in Singapore. Initially, everything seemed to go well and the ship glided smoothly out of the shipyard. However, it began to tilt to the right side. It was evident that the ship's center of gravity was shifted to the right, probably due to some equipment that was not properly secured inside the ship and ended up shifting from its correct position. Despite this, the ship did not sink and continues in full activity. Launching a ship from the side is always impressive to witness. This method is used when it is not possible to build a dry dock perpendicular to the coast, for example when the shipyard is located on the banks of a river or canal. This case occurred on February 15, 2019, in the Netherlands, where the Royal Boat West Company held the launching ceremony for the cargo ship Tasman. The ceremony went extremely smoothly and the spectators seemed pleased. The ship glided majestically through the narrow channel, raising large waves and rocking nearby boats. However, an official decided to remove an obstacle and did not notice that the ship began to move towards the channel. What saved him was his ability to react immediately and his extreme jumping ability. Someone should receive safety training. That was on May 18, 2014, and now you will see how $10 million has turned into a huge pile of junk. That is the value of this yacht about to be launched. However, the yacht starts to tilt to the left side, and a total disaster happens. The cause of this was an error in recording the yacht's weight during construction, the result of a figure that one employee wrote down with a thick pencil and another employee misinterpreted. 
Based on these figures, the designer modified the design of the yacht, shifting the center of gravity to the left without any basis. The cost of this error was $10 million. In 2019, the launch of the Scott Explorer ship took place at the Royal Shipyard in the Netherlands, but this time things did not go so well. The work team put in their best efforts, the employees removed the supports and launched the ship, sliding towards the channel. However, at the most crucial moment, one of the cables did not resist and broke. This turned the launching ceremony into an exciting and suspenseful event. Because the ship was only partially secured, a giant wave formed and the surrounding area was flooded. Then the right side of the ship collided violently with the channel wall. Let's take a look at the perspective of the anxious onlookers who gathered near the channel to capture impactful images. Fortunately, there were no injuries in the incident, but the camera was blown away impressively by the waves. There are people who possess the perfect timing to make a recording. It is an impressive skill of intuition. In the background, the ship is being launched into the water at exactly this moment, everything seems to be going according to plan, but the ship is leaning to the left side. As a result, this video spread quickly. The launch in which the ship passes over the airbags is an interesting event in itself. However, sometimes things do not go according to plan. A routine task turns into an unusual scene. This happened with a tourist boat in China, where the boat was supposed to glide smoothly into the water, but ended up stranded. Probably, the slope of the shore was not sufficient and the airbags did not slide properly into the water. Ultimately, the launch ceremony was marked by the failure of the first attempt. How to ruin an elegant and extremely expensive yacht? Just by attaching the crane cables carelessly, with a single movement the yacht slides straight into the water, as if a fish escaped from the hands of an unlucky fisherman. In Romania, there are always very interesting ship launching ceremonies going on. In 2013, an exclusive Navy sailing ship was launched, and as you can see, these ships are currently only used for training. The launching ceremony was impressive, the ship looked like it was going to sink from the right side, but suddenly it leveled off and revealed its dazzling presence with its three masts. However, did you notice that there were people on board the ship? Imagine how these people felt when the ship tilted dramatically. On May 17th, they decided to launch a small boat using a 50-ton crane, believing that this would be sufficient. However, because the crane arm was too long in relation to the counterweight, something went wrong. The crane and the boat ended up falling into the river. The scene is funny, despite the losses. The use of airbags is a very economical technique. It is enough to position the ship on them to lower it into the water. However, the ship needs to be handled with extreme caution. If there is an error in the calculation of the ballast or the center of gravity, as we can see, the ship can capsize and sink, drifting away from the shore along with the disappointed crew. It seems that no one was hurt on board, but everyone must have released a lot of adrenaline.
That's it for today folks. Thanks for watching. If you like this content, share it with your friends. Leave your comment, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and activate the bell to receive notifications.